It's Saturday night, and I'm Pastor Rick Jones. And it's great to have my daughter with us on this Mother's Day weekend. When I was growing up, my mother, who was a very, very, is a very godly mother, uh, many, many times would just break out in a prayer. I mean, it might be we were in the car and she'd break out in a prayer because it looked like we we're going to have a wreck. <laughs> or she might have a prayer in the middle of the kitchen because of something that's happened there. Or the phone would ring and she would just cry out and start praying. And I remember that. She learned very early on the importance of leaning on the Lord Jesus. And mothers, I suppose, feel that more pressure than than others because they're so worried about their children and they want them to love the Lord and live for Christ. But through all of the circumstances of life, there is nothing more fundamental, more basic than this lesson that John Stallings writes about in this uh, old, old uh, gospel song. I'm learning to lean on Jesus. I hope you are. And I hope we all are. Because that's the one who can take us through every trial. Praise God.
not just sing about it and not just know it in our minds that we need to lean, but give us, Lord, the grace and the heart and the willingness to lean. Sometimes we like to think we can figure it all out. We like to think we can give all the answers. We like to think we can power our way through it. But we realize, Lord, we've got to lean on you. So give us, Lord, that grace. Bless all the dear mothers on this wonderful weekend that we celebrate our good, godly mothers. Thank you for mothers who taught us to lean on Jesus. And we pray, Lord, that you'd be with them today. Pray for those that are older and life's a little tougher for them today. Help them to lean on Jesus. Pray for those that are younger and trying to figure out how to raise their children up in the nurture of the Lord in the middle of a culture that is so anti-Christ. Help them to lean on Jesus. And help us all, Lord, to learn that lesson that by ourselves we're weak. But if we'll trust in the Lord with all our hearts and lean not to our own understanding, but in all our ways acknowledge Him, He will direct our paths. Be with those who are preaching the gospel around the world tomorrow. Give them grace, we pray. Souls, we pray for their the harvest. We ask, Lord, that many would be swept into the kingdom. And we'll give you praise for asking. Once again, a special blessing on our mothers. In Jesus' name.